YouTube, it's Philo here, and today I have another really in-depth review of a video game that just came out today. Um, I've been playing it all night, and I have. it took me a little while to realize it, but uh, um, this game, well, for, it didn't take me a while to realize this part, but I, reala I realized there's, like, there's something up with this game that just seems completely unoriginal and just boring. And I'm like, of course, this is a rip-off of two worlds, just like Elder Scrolls V. The, uh, before I get any farther, the game that I'm talking about is called The Witcher Triple I Wild Hunt. Um, the Witcher Triple I Wild Hunt. So I go to Walmart at midnight because everyone's like, this game has got good reviews on the Meaty Critic uh, website. So I look for the 3DS version because I have the 3DS XL. And um, so I asked for that, and the guy's like, the game is not on 3DS. And I'm like, of course, every single game that's... They have a console version and a, and a handheld version. They didn't apparently have it in the store. So I was like, whatever, what version do you have? Like, we have the, the PS3 and the Xbox One version. So I said, give me the PS3 version. So I, I pick up the PS3 version. And it's actually... They gave me the PS4 version. I'm like, I'm like guys, this says PS4. Um, and they're like, okay, yeah, but whatever. Anyways, I, I finally get home and I start playing the PS4 version and I'm like, okay, you gotta like ride a horse and like run around and kill bad guys and stuff. And I'm like, this game seems so familiar. This is like every other role playing game. Um, like, like, uh, like, you know, Bethesda did with Oblivion and Skyrim and Morrowinds and, you know, like Two Worlds, which is a really great game. Two Worlds is probably the only good one I'm talking about, um. And the Final Fantasy X, Triple I, and all those other ones. And I'm like, oh man, it's another one of these. Like, aren't people just sick and tired of these? Why do they keep making these? You know what this game reminded me of? It was like a ripoff of Assassin's Creed, the original one. The only good Assassin's Creed game was the original one. Um, and even that one is just kind of iffy at times. But it's just like, like ah, oh, like, uh, for, okay, besides it being just completely unoriginal, here are some things about it. It's a PlayStation 4 game. It should have really good graphics. It doesn't. This game looks like it came out in 2004. It looks like a, it looks like a PS2 game. It's that bad. It's, it, I was like, I was like, this game is really unfinished. That's really um, embarrassing. Um, what else did I write down? The count, the, the, the fact that there's only a console version and not a handheld version is just frustrating. And it, it's just a ripoff. There's nothing original in this game whatsoever. And I'm like, is this what game developers do nowadays? They find things that are popular in other games and then just, like, take elements and, like, look, we made an original game. It's called The Witcher Triple I Wild Hunt. Yay! And then it's just like, no, nothing. Nothing's original. So if you have to go to the store and you want to buy a game, don't buy The Witcher Triple I Wild Hunt. Pick up a good classic game like um, like Duke Nukem Forever or uh, the new Sim City that came out a year or two ago is pretty great. Um, these are pretty good games. Um, but don't waste your time with The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. Um it's just, it's just not worth it. So that's all I have to say for now. Uh, I'll be doing plenty more reviews soon. Let me know what you guys think. If you do agree with me, um, or if are you, if you disagree with me, then you're wrong. But if you agree with me and you're smart, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Thanks. Bye.